week. And as you can see, today I am in a little bit of a change of scenery again. Um, I've come out of my living room and I'm into my hallway now. I know it's a really, really random place to be to film a workout, but trust me, it has actually really worked. So that's because I need a door frame for this workout and I also need a spare open wall. And apparently the hall is the only place in my house which has both of these right next to each other. So it's perfect. So for today's exercise, we are gonna mix it up and do a resistant band exercises along with wall exercises. So we're gonna alternate them and we're gonna do a resistant band, then a wall one, then a resistant band, then a wall one, then a resistant band. So we're gonna do five exercises and we're gonna work for 40 seconds and then have 20 seconds off and then do another 40 seconds and then have another 20 seconds off. So all together we'll be doing 10 times and then we'll finish off with a five minute cool down. So I hope that makes sense and you will need a few pieces of equipment for this exercise. So as you can see, I have got my TheraBands here and I've attached it to the wall, I mean the door frame. So if you do have the TheraBands, all you need to do is hook it over the door frame and shut the door so the door is nice and secure and the TheraBand won't ping back into your face. You can also do this with your tights, so you just need to hook it over the door or your inner tube, hook that over the door too, and then shut the door. So really make sure whatever is in the door is nice and secure so it doesn't ping back into your face. I don't really want to be responsible for injuring anyone, so sorry, really make sure that it's nice and secure first. You also then need another TheraBand, which you can um, use freely uh, away from a door. Um, so I've got a medium resistant one, so hopefully that will work me nice and hard, especially if we're going for 40 seconds. And then finally, as you can see on my wall, I've got several markers. I've got some purple markers and I've got some blue markers. Um, so I've literally just used some post-it notes for this, some post-it note arrows. I love a good bit of stationery and my dad doesn't want me to mark the wall. So I've used these, these lovely colourful post-it notes. So the purple means um, is for one exercise and the blue is for another exercise. So hopefully that will all become clear in a minute. Um, but guys, on a serious note, as always, really make sure that you uh, seek medical advice from your GP or healthcare professional before taking part in anything in this video, because I don't want to injure you and it's all down to your own risk. So please stay safe and don't injure yourself. So we're just going to start off though, as usual, with a five minute warm up, because it's always really important to warm your muscles up. So I'll start the timer now and off we go. We're just going to start off with those waving hands that we did in the no exercise video and you're just going to wave them like this. So you're going to switch from up to down, up to down. And you're just going to go at a nice steady pace for a minute. Make sure it's nice and easy. And make sure you keep your elbows up. Really good. Sorry if you can hear my kitchen from here. I can't shut the door because there is no door between my hallway and the kitchen. So if you hear like co coffee being made or something, I'm really sorry, but um, hopefully the music will cover that up. We're just going to do this for another 10 seconds. Then we're going to speed it up. So three, two, one. You're just going to speed it up. And work really hard. We need 20 seconds of fast. Got another 10 seconds to go fast. Keep going. Really good. Sorry, you can hear all the Three, two, one. And stop there. Well done. Have a nice shake out. Make sure your arms are nice and loose. And we're going to go into another exercise now, which I think we've done in another work, uh, warm up before. And we're just going to wind the bobbin up and then bring it back down. Got a nice steady pace. So you really are working those muscles. And then we'll speed it up. In about 20 seconds or so. And hopefully, warm my muscles up. Really good. And in 10 seconds, we're gonna go slightly faster. 
I'll tell you when, don't you worry. Five, four, three, two, one, and we're just gonna go really fast now. Up. And then, down. We're going to do this for 20 seconds. Sorry, my family just can't keep quiet. I don't know why. Can't do it. And you've got five seconds left. Let's go. Keep going fast. Three, two, one. And stop there. While well, we're done, guys. Shake it all out. Have a nice get hand for And we're going to go into our lawn mowers now because we haven't done them for a while. We're just going to go on short. One long, one short, one long. I'm gonna do ten each arm. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and switch arm. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and one more, ten. Shake it off and finish off with some neck rolls. We're just going to go five one way. our main workout now and we're going to start off with our first exercise. Our first exercise is going to be what we call Y flies and so you do need to attach your TheraBand onto the door for this or your tights or whatever you're using. Make sure it's nice and secure and what we're going to do is we're going to face the door, we're going to have a nice good posture, shoulders down, make sure your shoulders are back as well so you feel like you're pinching a pencil at the back of your shoulder blades. So you've got really good posture, really good core going on, and we're simply just going to pull our TheraBand down with a, in a Y shape, and then go back up and then pull it down. I'm going to be facing the door when I do this, obviously, but I just couldn't demonstrate that to you whilst I've got my back to you. So I will face the door, and just, it's just really important, guys, to make sure you've got really good posture when you're doing this, and we're just going to pull it down and go back up. So we've got about five seconds and then we're going to work for 40 seconds and off we go took a swing at a wrecking ball and i prayed for my downfall and i found a way to reconcile because in my heart it's not worthwhile it's a bloody battlefield where some go down others heal in the end it's all the same all you can do is play the game Five seconds left guys, three, two, one, and stop there. Well done, right we've got 20 seconds left now, 20 seconds rest sorry, um, so really make sure you can recover. Sorry if my, look, my, my back looks a bit twisted when I do it, I've got rods in my back so um, my back isn't completely straight, so it might look a bit funny. I'm going to go in five seconds time again. Three. Two, one, and off we go. Go, guys. 
If I stop at any point, just to check the timer, don't worry, you guys carry on and um, make sure you do your workout properly. <laughs> so, we're going to go, that's our first exercise done. We're going to go to our second exercise now, which we're going to do on our wall. So, we're going to be using the purple markers for this. And what it's going to be called is just alternate side reaches. So, as you can see, I've got four markers for purple. One, two, three and four and so I put two closer in and then two further away so all I'm going to be doing is facing the wall and I'm going to reach to the, um, the closer ones first so one, two and then I'm going to reach up further one, two, one, two, three, four one, two, three, four one, two, three, four so the idea is that this drill is quite fast paced and you really test your agility 40 seconds. So I'm going to face the wall and we're going to go in three, two, one, and off we go. Make sure you keep your shoulders nice and level too. 
I'm sorry, I'm trying to keep yeah. my chair still and quiet, but I need to racket my chair, so I'm very sorry. And we're gonna go again. Three, two, one, and off we go. to our fourth exercise, so well done, we're powering through them. And we've done this before in our outside workout, so you will remember it. So you need to set up, we're gonna be using the blue markers this time, and you need to set up six random markers that are just out of your reach, or just in within, within your reach, sorry. And so they really test your reach and um, test your agility. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna face the wall and just at random, Markers, you're just going to reach random markers and different sequence and just really test your ability to go as fast as possible. So we're going to go in five, four, three, two, one, and off we go. Doing this in 14 seconds is actually quite hard. You can have a short attention on it. 
but we are just going to finish off with a few static stretches because we don't want to injure our muscles. So have your arm nice and straight, across it across your body and support it with the other hand. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and switch side. So straight arm, cross your body and support it with the other hand. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Go, cool. shake it off. And you're just going to reach up, drop the arm down, and if you can, pull across with the other hand. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And switch sides, so drop it up, drop it down, and pull it across. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We're just going to twist in our chairs guys, so you're just going to hold the opposite back side of the back rest and twist your body around. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And switch around to the other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And come back to the middle. And we'll just finish off with our neck stretches because it's really important to stretch your neck out too. Three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and switch sides. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Cool, and shake it all out, guys. Grab a final drink. Make sure you're nice and hydrated. So that is another workout complete, guys. Well done, you've done just over 20 minutes there. So if you've really worked hard, well done. I hope you've liked mixing it up between the TheraBands and the wall. So I hope that's been good, hope you've enjoyed it. And I will back again next week with another workout. In the meantime, guys, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Keep following me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and like my pages. And then hopefully we can spread the word and more and more people can get involved. Thanks, Thanks so much, guys. Have a really good week, and I'll see you next week. Bye.